Welcome to this short video on exporting an IFC. The first thing you need to have is you need to have an IFC configuration already created. And as you can see in mine, I have three configurations already created, as you can see underneath Smart IFC Export. We have three ways to be able to export out an IFC. You can export out just the geometry. You can also export out the geometry with the data attached to it. And the last one is you can export out the geometry with the data attached and also map it so pipes know their pipes, elbows know their elbows. I'm gonna go ahead and do the last one with the mapping. With IFC, it'll export out everything that is shown on screen. So if you don't want everything exported out, you need to make sure you hide it. So I'm gonna hide a few items here. I'm just gonna grab this data here. I'm gonna select hide unselected. So that's all I'm gonna export out as an IFC. Now I'm gonna go ahead and click on export with mapping. A dialog box comes up to where I can give it a project name, the organization, the site name, the building name, and the author. I'm not gonna worry about that. I'm just gonna click okay. Then it wants to know where you're gonna put this. So I'm gonna put this on my desktop and I'm gonna call this one export IFC with mapping. And I'm gonna go save. And this is now going to export out this IFC. So this will take a few seconds. The larger the model, of course, is going to take a little longer. And it says it was finished. I'm going to OK this. Now I'm going to go ahead and open this uh, IFC up in uh, Navisworks here. So I'm going to go in here and open. I'm going to change this to IFC. I'm going to go to my desktop. And there it is, Export IFC with Mapping. And I'm going to click Open. And I'm not going to save this one. And this will take a few moments to uh, come up. IFCs all do this. Here my IFC has finally come up. So let's just go ahead and put this in here. And so here's the IFC. You can see everything. If I go into the tree view here, it's got the IFC project, the site, the building, the level zero. And then generic models are things that I didn't map. Then I have some pipe fittings in here. I also have some pipes. If I click on one of these objects in here, I still have all the properties that I exported out with it. This concludes this short video on exporting an IFC.